A scorching hot Saturday leaves hundreds heading to the pool. One metro area pool saw lines so long that people had to receive medical attention while waiting to get inside. Fox 9's Rob Olson spoke to some people at Bunker Beach Water Park who are feeling the heat. Rob? Yeah, I tell you what, a lot of people looking to escape the heat, even being out in it to escape the heat. We're at Nokomis Beach in Minneapolis. Uh, still, uh, you know, it's thinning out, but there's still quite a few people here at this time of night. And, of course, it's still 91 degrees. A few hours ago, you couldn't even find a parking spot here. It was so popular. A lot of people, though, searching for a way to cool down. And as you mentioned, at Bunker Beach up in Coon Rapids, so many people turned out that they were waiting in line in the parking lot. And that led to trouble. We were in this line like an hour and a half. It was heat, she had heat exhaustion. Cindy Wadan brought her grandkids to Bunker Beach Water Park for its opening day. Quickly discovered a whole lot of other people had the same idea. Opening at 11, a supervisor told me the line began forming at 9:45. This video from a viewer shows the backup of cars just to get to the parking lot, where people then stood over an hour on blacktop. By the time she walked through the gates around 12.30, the long wait had taken its toll on 13-year-old Bryn. And I felt like I couldn't hear. I heard ringing, and I could not see. Like, I, I went blurry, I went black, and then I didn't know what the... I don't remember after I didn't see anything black. And then I woke up on the ground, and then they were giving me, like, oxygen. She was the first. Not long after, more followed, collapsing from heat exhaustion. She started it out, and then there was many ambulances here all day long. As crews got on scene, we started developing more and more patients that were going down that uh, needed some additional assistance from from EMS. Inspector House called this the perfect storm, opening day of a park that couldn't open at all last year on a day pushing 100. He estimated between 10 and 20 people needed help and several taken by ambulance. We eventually got enough uh, resources here on scene, kind of set up a triage area. For a time, they closed the lot and stopped selling admission to prevent more people from lining up in the heat. To make sure a day in the park was just that, Cindy praised the staff. For their response. They have the best people here. They had the oxygen on her, umbrellas. I mean, they jumped to it like the minute we walked in that door, she hit the ground, they were on it. Yeah, and they were handing out water too to those people that were uh, standing in line before they were able to kind of disperse the line to prevent any more problems. But a, a very warm day, uh, cooling down now. You know, one guy just drove by and yelled at me, you know, it's not that hot outside. Because <laughs> we're down to 91, so it's all relative. It actually feels pretty good now, Karen. Yeah, the 